The race for U.S. Senate in Pennsylvania is incredibly tight. And one of the most recent polls by Emerson College has Senator Bob Casey leading challenger Dave McCormick 47 to 45. That's a statistical tie when you factor in the margin of error of 3%. And today McCormick was hoping to sway some voters. The campaign stops in Pittsburgh. Ross Gadotti has more. Dave McCormick spoke to a group of veterans here today at a VFW in Morningside, telling them that he believes he's the answer when it comes to leadership in the Senate in the state of Pennsylvania. Walking into VFW Post 3945, the man who would be the Republican senator for the state of Pennsylvania received a hero's introduction from United States Senator and fellow Republican Dan Sullivan of Alaska. We need Dave McCormick, right? yes. the next United States Senator. McCormick, who served as an officer in the Army during Operation Desert Storm in 1991, immediately targeted his opponent, Democratic Senator and incumbent Bob Casey. A lack of courage, a lack of moral clarity, a lack of leadership, that is what is taking our country in the wrong direction. McCormick also questioning Casey on economic policy, saying he's locked arm in arm with the Biden administration. Bob Casey's running on Bidenomics, are you kidding me? 60% of Pennsylvanians live paycheck to paycheck. KDKA met up with McCormick after his visit and asked him specifically about plans to protect and help veterans, including funding increases for the Veterans Administration, specifically for veterans health care. Absolutely, it's just, it needs to be well spent funding. But if it's money that's going to the heart of the problem, which is a mental health crisis among veterans that's leading to suicide, absolutely. In Morningside, Ross Gadotti, KDKA TV News.